<laughs> hey up, welcome back. Right, we've just had a two hour drive, oh, Tracy's drove, I've been co pilot, and uh, just arrived at this air. Uh, I think the place is called Brogley, or Brogley. Uh, we weren't sure what to expect, but as you can see, it's absolutely, well, it's lovely, it's gorgeous. Uh, yeah, like I said, we've literally just arrived, so we did look around the village here. It looks nice, village, it's historic. Lots of old buildings and stuff, which we like to see. Uh, if you look down here, I don't know if you can see that, but uh, a bit of a lake down there to do a spot of fishing. Get into that type of thing. And that's where we are, that's where we parked up. We've practically got the place to the centre, so that's not too bad. Hey, oh, look who's here. Toffee? Toffee? Hey! That is not your van, mate. Oi! Johnny! Come here! <laughs> It's a, it's a nosy bugger. <laughs> right, well, it's time to put kettle on. So, actually, I said kettle. We're going to treat ourselves with a glass of red wine. We just bought some nice uh, Bordeaux wine from little little supermarket. It's only about eight and a half euros for a three litre box. It's absolutely lovely. So, yeah, Trace. It's a bit midgy, so I've got a fly screen up. I'll put a yeah. candle on. Ooh. Yeah, she says measure. There's like these little, if you can see them, like tiny little, tiny little flies. They're not going to hurt you. I don't think they bite or anything. They just, they just. They, I think they're attracted to white, to white on van. So anyway, we're gonna leave, uh, leave you now. And we'll catch up later. Yeah, Trace. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> There's Trace. Hey, what, love? Just knocking a bit of lunch up. Yeah. What are we having? Uh, we're having some salad because I think we need it. Ooh, salad. I think we need it. Uh, talk for this then, love. Talking <laughs> for thee. <laughs> uh, what are we having with salad? Are we having just lettuce? Just lettuce. That's it. That's all you need. I'll put a bit of apple on for you because I know you like apple. Yeah, can I have a bit of bread with mine? Yeah, of course you can. Lovely. Oh, I can't wait, the mouth, the mouth running. <laughs> We're running away. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
Nice. Oh yeah. Your crispies on. Throw me some. Yeah. Lovely. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Nice. Mm. Mm. Nice there. Mm. Even nicer. <laughs> say what? <laughs> say what? Say what you want about French. They're great pastry. <laughs> oh. So this is another one of our many jobs. So let me get on a campsite. We have to take this little pest out for a walk. <laughs> Then. Some people might think it's a bit strange taking your cat for a walk. It is. <laughs> uh, well, it is a bit strange, isn't it? It's a bit weird. But then again, he's a bit weird. He's there, look. And of course, because he slavels, slavels, because he travels with slow coaches. He's slow. Yeah. He himself is a slow coach. Uh, one of his favourite pastimes, the old tree scratch. Deep in thought, there, look. Oh, yes, that's lovely. Mm. Mm. Might have a climb up there later. This is about as exciting as it gets, taking a cat for a walk. So, wrap that up and catch you later. Where are we, son? Hey. <laughs> Morning. Gorgeous day. Uh, yesterday we had a much round village. So it's a lovely site, so we thought we'd have a little walk today, but about five mile and we'll take you along with us, looking gorgeous as ever. And uh, see you later. Bye! <laughs> Mind you, they all look 
So we set this walk. We don't know. We don't know where we're going to finish up. I've just literally found a, a route on the walking app on my phone, and we're going to see where it takes us. Which is usually good fun. Okay. So I think this could be Office of Tourism. Office de Tourisme, as we say in French. Tourist office, to me and you. Right, so we found this first, this first track, this first trail. Uh, and it's up this, this pathway here. Now what we've noticed is, when you're walking around in France, they have these marks. Uh, and we think that each each colour represents a different path, so there'll be a yellow trail, a green trail, these two lines together will be, well, yellow and red trail. Uh, and we'll see these as we're going up here. If we come across any more, we'll show you. So we've walked about 20 yards up this path, 30 yards and look. Some more of these marks here. So we know we're going right way. Walking in this uh, ancient woodland for about an hour now, uh, and as you can see, it's uh, like an autumnal scene. Anyway, this is the marks I was telling you about earlier. So, this tells you that your path veers off to the right, these two trails are blue and a yellow, and then as you come down this path, you look around, and as you can see here. So we've got crosses on here, basically it's saying, you don't go that way, you have a look round, and if you look on this tree here, yeah, so that tells us we're down that way, and then Tracy being a clever clogs, she's already found it, she already knows where we're going, so I'm going to follow Tracy for a bit, she's the tracker, what's that love? Oh yeah, if you're walking the other way. It shows you that it's left. Yeah, yeah, there's some marks on that tree there. Look. Just tell you that it's a left turn. So it's a clever system and it works, you've just got to keep your eyes peeled. Well, that was that was interesting to see because they just look like puddles. These, I mean, they look like they're probably going to dry up unless there's a spring or something, you know, just under the surface. You know, a bit of water bearing stuff, something like that. But there's. Uh, there's loads here. in. There's little fish in here. There's some in here as well, look. Tracy says she just spotted some little fish. So. Ah, there's, ah, the tadpoles then. There's some tadpoles in there, and I've just seen some little fish. <laughs> Look at these. Or maybe newts. Yeah. 
Just swim under a oh, leaf there. Oh, aren't they cute little teddies? Yeah. Oh, ah, ah, the new slope. The new slope, there. That's that stick. Yeah. If you can see this, but there's a a little new there. I'm not going to hurt it. Nice. A little tadpole swimming around. So yeah, it's interesting to see that little ecosystem in what looks like a puddle. I mean, they're amphibians, aren't they? So it's just they can live in and out of water. Can't shallowest they? of puddles, though, isn't it? But you would think something like that just dry up and they just bugger off, but they're still here. Well, we think we found a bit more evidence of wildlife in uh, in these woods. Now, don't take my word for it, but. I think this is what uh, <laughs> what you call a badger latrine. So what the badger does is he, he digs a little hole and uh, he drops last night's supper in there. So yeah, I think that's what that is. Badger latrine. Right, we've just come up that woodland path there and uh well i'll go this way because from right down there i thought oh this is a bush shelter we'll sit and have his lunch yeah somebody's little shed and then middle of nowhere there's and then that's road back which is miles middle of nowhere there's just this house weird mm, i'm gonna sit and have his lunch but it's a bit tooty fruity a bit to ansel and gretel so if you don't see us again Come and find us here. We might be in that, uh, as bones might be in that bin there, smouldering. <laughs> so there's a couple places I'm coming across here. I mean, it's it's literally, it's middle of nowhere. Nothing <laughs> for miles around. Uh, but we've got some lunch to eat, so we're going to make for these rocks here and uh, catch it after lunch. Well, it's a great little spot, this. We've got one, two, three paths all coming together. Cute little house. Yeah. And then these rocks we chose for his lunch. They like they've got these uh, little little seats carved in them. It's like it's some sort of a, a monument. It's here for some reason. It's been been worked in somewhere. I don't know what for. Anyway, we're going to get something to eat now. So we're just over halfway, uh, done about five miles, and we had his lunch. I had salad and couscous and some mackerel. We've come to a nice little spot here, so we thought we'd just show you around. It's, uh, it's a beautiful forest. It looks almost autumnal, doesn't it? You know, it spotted. Yeah brown leaves down mm. but uh, it's nice spring is definitely spring right so we'll catch you later just come out of the woods and they've walked down this little street and it's just one of the most amazing little houses you've ever seen they're absolutely beautiful to look at they really are well did you enjoy your walk? yeah I love nice, weren't it? Yeah, it was really nice. Well, we covered eight miles. Yeah. And it <coughs> took us 1,050. Just dropped a bit cool now. And we're back at the village on Brogley. So, take a few snaps. Some stunning buildings to see.